Everyone laughed when he married a fat black girl, but two years later, they regretted it. I'm the only consistent person in my life, and so I better like myself, Gabori Sadib admitted on the conversation with Amanda de Kindet in 2015. The Oscar, BAFTA, and Golden Globe nominee has since found Brandon Frankel to be another reliable person in her life. Sadibi, who gained instant notoriety as the troubled teen lead in Lee Daniels' gripping movie Precious, had never before been romantically associated with anyone in the media. The New Yorker has, however, become a staple of tabloid magazines and Hollywood websites as a result of her turbulent love life since meeting the entertainment power player. Who is the man who won the actor's heart then? What brought them together? Why have we already seen him almost completely naked? The relationship that has Sadibi hearing wedding bells ringing in his ears is examined in details here. When and how Gabori Sadibi and Brandon Frankel first started dating is unknown. Nevertheless, the latter initially raised eyebrows in May 2019 when he shared a selfie of the two on Instagram. The marketing professional then appeared to confirm their relationship by sharing a more private photo with the remark, one of the world's most beloved people. I'll stop now so you can puke from cuteness. Frankel clarified matters even further in July of the same year when he uploaded a photo of a beaming Sadibi along with the words, This face is just too cute for words. GF my sunshine. The precious actor, however, made the decision to keep social media quiet about her new relationship until New Year's Eve. Instead, it seems as though Sadibi's goal for 2020 was to brag as much as she could about her new boyfriend. On December 31, 2019, Frankel posted a second Instagram snapshot of the couple, to which she included a remark, My favorite love song is about you. You serve as both the capstone and the cornerstone of the previous decade. The matching hoodies, Mickey and Minnie costumes for Disneyland, and your favorite clothes that somehow end up being my favorite shirts have me very excited. You make me joyful than I've ever been. I'm so happy we found each other, and from now on, whenever I see a dog in public, I'll shout and yell, Dog, for you. It appears that Gabori Sadibi's dating strategy of treat them nasty, keep them keen, worked out well for her. The actor said that she recently made the decision to modify her perspective about the other sex in an interview with Daily Beast in 2020 to promote her appearance in the controversial horror film Antebellum. The native of Brooklyn remarked, What they wanted from me didn't matter to me. I never intended to give them anything. I wouldn't care about or prepare food for males, Sadibi continued. It's like a silly thing I did for myself, as she giggled at the objectives she had set for herself. Nonetheless, the Oscar nominee later acknowledged that her stupid move had clearly worked in her favor, and then very fast after that I got a boyfriend. The celebrity had been dating Brandon Frankel for almost 16 months at this point. Sadibi also discussed how her antebellum character gave her the confidence to approach men with more assurance. Since Dawn is in command, I adore her so much. Dawn is the one in command of her sexuality and dates. Obviously, someone is staring at her from the other side of the bar. She is stunning. She is her own owner. Her space is hers. She also possesses autonomy in a way that I had to learn to understand. Almost 18 months after he started dating Gabori Sadibi in November 2020, Brandon Frankel made the choice to propose. Unsurprisingly, both parties were excited to announce on social media that they had become engaged. Frankel posted a brief video to Instagram showing his new fiancée flashing some expensive jewelry on her finger. I proposed to my best buddy, and she accepted. I can't wait to live out the rest of my days with the most brilliant, hilarious, stunning, and inspirational lady I've ever met. I cannot fathom living without you. We work as the best team and add fun and unique touches to everything. Sadibi shared the same video on her personal Instagram account and called Frankel the funniest man I've ever met and the sweetest human to exist. The Difficult People star continued, I guess our emotions and intentions for each other are just that plain to see, after revealing that some people had already believed they were married.
Anybody tries to separate Gabori Sidibe and her boyfriend Brandon Frankel will suffer the consequences. The American Horror Story star used the chance to warn off any followers, thinking of sending him a flirty message while simultaneously congratulating the latter on his 37th birthday. Extra reports that Sidibe made a wonderful first impression by addressing the birthday kid directly. You are the world's funniest, kindest, toughest, and most protective man. You are the Kel to my Kanan, the Rami to my Michelle, and the Bert to my Ernie, whereas anyone may be the Clyde to my Bonnie. During the rest of our life, I can't wait to pull you along on adventures, my sweetheart. Happy birthday. But just to make sure that everyone knew that Frankel was now engaged, the Golden Globe nominee then switched from being a woman to be wished well to being a woman not to be trifled with by posting on her Instagram story a screenshot of a message from a woman addressed to her boyfriend. You are also DMing me if you DM him. If this blank were in a full body cast, I would beat the brakes out of her and that blank wouldn't be worth blank. It appears that Brandon Frankel approached Gabori Sidibe through a variety of approaches. He got one of their cats involved in the proposal by using a charm that asks, Would you marry my daddy? in a photo he posted on Instagram. Another depicts him placing numerous enormous balloons in the shape of the words, Would you marry me? on a bed covered in rose petals. Yet, the since-deleted snapshot Sidibe posted to commemorate her fiancé's birthday a month later suggests that there was more to the latter than first appeared to be the case. And nudity was involved. Yep, Frankel is visible in this startlingly unguarded photo, clutching two well-placed balloons that helped him complete his bedroom proposal. The Empire actor, according to the Daily Mail, captioned this picture, You are the world's funniest, nicest, toughest, and most protective man. You always agree to my wacky plans, whether they involve getting your nails done, indulging in ice cream made with rice noodles and rose water, or participating in insane picture shoots like this one. You'll see that Gabori Sidibe and Brandon Frankel both share more pictures of their feline pals than they do of each other if you browse through their Instagram pages. Certainly, the couple seems to have an obsession with cats and frequently refers to their animals as their children. Sadly, the American Horror Story actor lost one of her previous moggies early in 2020 as she shared with her Instagram fans alongside many images. I bid this precious tiny lady, Peaches, farewell with a sorrowful heart. Pets serve as a constant reminder that we should love everyone in our lives completely while we still have the chance to do so. I appreciate your perfection and protection, Peach. Your dad, me, and Aaron are all missing you. Though Aaron is trying to comfort us as best as he can, Peaches, you are loved. The other cat that the celebrity adopted in 2017 is named Aaron, and he later received a new playmate named Daryl Germain Dupree Sadibi Frankel. If you can survive the cuteness overload, check out this lovely video of one being teased with spaghetti and this equally gorgeous picture of the other being carried around in a transparent backpack. The two are frequently featured on social media. Gabori Sidibe was publicly humiliated in a meme that rapper Twista posted on his Instagram page in December 2020. The model and Oscar nominee, Bernice Burgo, are unintentionally pitted against one another in the photo. According to Independent, with the former's caption reading, Stay couch to couch, no car. 12,000 followers on Instagram. Three kids, three beds, and the latter reading, staying $30 an hour, own house, own car, and no kids. The next step is for followers to select between options A and B. Nevertheless, Sadibi quickly got her own back by throwing some excellent shade in the comments section. Amazing. I'm sorry. Gee, you're just a rapper I forgot about in 2005 that I like. But good luck with the choice, B. The Tower Heist actor was able to put Twista in his place without any assistance. She did, however, receive some support from her fiancé, Brandon Frankel, who added, See, you need a job. The Slow Jam singer apologized for sharing the offensive meme after this too-prolonged onslaught telling The Shade Room that it had been an honest mistake. Moreover, the rapper, who also chose to delete the post, said, I'm sorry if that I offended anyone, and I regret that. When I discovered the error, 
I was out and about much of the day, so I promptly got it corrected. Although I don't personally know her, I sincerely apologize to her. So everyone is aware of Gabori Sidibi's methods for making ends meet, but what about her fiancé, Brandon Frankel? He has, in fact, been a senior talent executive at the personalized video company Cameo since the summer of 2020, according to his LinkedIn page. Frankel has previously worked with companies like Sony Music, Masterworks, Paradigm Talent Agency, and Atlantic Records. He currently owns the marketing and brand partnerships between Contra Incorporated. In a 2017 Billboard article that stated Frankel has racked up frequent flyer miles in pursuit of branding opportunities for his clients traveling to Mumbai and with Major Lazer for the opening ceremonies of the Indian Premier League cricket finals and to a mall in Moscow with Young Lean for a Calvin Klein campaign. Sadibi's bow was listed as one of the world's major players in the branding industry. Frankel appears to have no qualms about utilizing his connections to obtain his girlfriend the newest fashions. It might seem that Gabori Sidibi and Brandon Frankel talk about their love for one another all the time. Despite this, they still find humor in their picture-perfect relationship, which they love to post on social media. Sidibi responded to an inquisitive admirer who questioned, Does your man have a name? next to a photo of Frankel cooking on Instagram, but saying, I think so, but at this point in the relationship, I'm too embarrassed to ask him. The antebellum actress previously claimed on Twitter that Frankel had sent her a bunch of red roses and a unicorn named Olive, you, for the most romantic day of the year, before adding, my Valentine is a dork and I couldn't be happier to have him. Yet Frankel is also capable of dishing out the fake insults. In an Instagram selfie, his fiancés remarked, My man said I looked like a really cool brat stall. All I've ever wanted is that. During the coronavirus pandemic, quarantining together created or ruined many partnerships. Fortunately for Gabori Sadibi and Brandon Frankel, it appears that their lockdown time fell into the first group. Since seeking refuge from the epidemic in early 2020, the couple hasn't stopped waxing poetic about how much they loved being in each other's company. Frankel commented in an Instagram old photo of the couple attending an NBA game, I wish you had a fantastic quarantine companion like I have. It's been strange yet pleasant to hide away with someone you love during this time. In an interview with People magazine, Sidibi also discussed their living arrangements, making fun of Frankel and joking that she was extremely blessed to have me, said she. It's really nice that he will eat anything I put in front of him. I keep forcing him to drink sweet potato juice while I exercise in our gym, but I apologize. I do not sound at all like Gwyneth Paltrow. As you may anticipate, Gabori Sidibi and Brandon Frankel support one another equally when it comes to their professional obligations. He expressed his happiness on Instagram after learning that his fiance had been nominated for Best Supporting Actress at the NAACP Image Awards for her work in Antebellum. I'm always impressed and happy of how diligent and committed she is in all she does. She improvised, made this persona her, and nailed it. I adore you to death and think you deserve everything. Frankel has previously gushed over Sidibe's portrayal of Dawn in the popular horror film. In September 2020, after seeing the movie for the first time, he gushed on Instagram, she not only makes everyone laugh and shines brightly, but honking is now accepted, clapping at drive-in movies. She received, we may say, a lot of honks. I'm really grateful for you because you are beautiful on the inside and out, and you look beautiful. Sadibi hasn't been as complimentary of her husband's work as she could be, but she was really thrilled with one particular accomplishment. Frankel posted a picture of herself clutching a platinum disc on Instagram with the caption, Interesting fact, before Brandon told me he received a platinum plaque from Little Kim's La Bella Mafia, I paid no attention to anything he had to say. At that point, I chose to give him some standards.